Hey everyone and welcome back to this Wikipedia. Today we're looking at a Samsung monitor uh, that I was using recently that uh, let the magic smoke out. Um, now what was happening was every time the fridge turned on and off the, uh, the monitor would flicker at the same time. Um, and usually what's inside a lot of electronics to stop this is a varista. Um, they basically suppress voltage spikes and transient voltages. Um, but obviously there's only so many times it can do that before it's going to fail. And um, yeah, this one was just slowly getting worse and worse until eventually yeah, it, it, it burnt itself to a crisp. Um, so we're going to replace that. But yeah, if you've got electronic devices that are um, prone to, you know, things like uh, compressors and that sort of thing clicking on and off, uh, chances are that you may need a new Varista soon. So um, we're going to replace the one in this and uh, see if we can get it working again. All right, so here's the power supply out of the monitor. Um, yeah, the, the Varista was right here next to this big cap, and there was also another one directly next to that. I uh, also had to take out one of the smaller caps because it has swollen, um, possibly due to that failure. Um, but the bigger one I've tested, and it still seems to be okay, so that's good. I don't have to replace that, but um, here's the replacements that I've got. Now, these are um, a higher value than the originals, um, which will hopefully last a lot longer. So, I mean, if you've got something, like I said, that's that's flickering on and off, um, it could be just that these are underrated uh, for that particular circuit. But um, yeah, we're going to replace these three components, and um, hopefully that should get us up and running again. Oh, and if you are working on power supplies uh, with bigger filter caps like this one on it, um, always make sure to just discharge them first. You can just uh, just short something metal across its terminals. Um, it may spark if there was charge left, but it's better than um, it's better than you feeling that spark. Um, yeah, let's stick it back in the monitor and see if this thing works. All right, so you can see the little scorch mark that it left. Let's put it back in, in that little groove. That's better. All right, let's connect everything and apply some power and hope that it doesn't explode again. Well, power has been applied. I can't see the screen powering on though. It's not cooking or anything. Ha! I think I just realized what the issue was. And 
For anyone of those keen-eyed viewers, you've probably already seen what I did wrong. But in case you missed it, what's this? What is this? Yeah, that would have helped. Right. that Try again, no smoke. I can see an LED on, whoop. So I may actually have to connect something. Right, so there we go, it works. Uh, it's not bothered by the fridge clicking off anymore and uh, it's not gonna end up in landfill or piling up in e-waste somewhere. Um, so it's a win-win. Um, so yeah, if you've got some electronic devices that uh, playing up when things like fridges and compressors click on and off it may be worth checking out the varistas um, then again it may not be um, there's currently a storm rolling in here so we'll see how it fares with that but um, I don't know if it'll protect us from lightning strikes um, but they are some pretty chunky varistas so who knows maybe it will maybe it'll be the only thing that survives anyway Thanks for watching this Wikipedia. Uh, as always, don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed this. And be sure to check out my other channel, the Retro Channel, for all your retro needs. Uh, until then, thanks for watching. Be sure to like, leave me a comment, all those kind of things. And I will see you again soon. Cheers.